What's up, everybody? It is Mick again from the Uncaped Crusaders. Links down below. I have my last unboxing for a day, so based on what you've seen, maybe it's your first one. Go back, check out some of the other ones. Um, unless you like Bam, then don't, because I kind of pick on them a bit. But this is a box of Dread, which this is only my second ever box of Dread, which to be honest with you, I never bought one. Um, I did a favor for somebody, I was watching the dog, and they sent me a box that was very nice to them. I enjoyed the stuff I got in the last one. Not necessarily stuff I would have caused me to run out and subscribe, but I think I got a, a cool DVD, which I already had a copy of, but I passed along to someone who didn't. I got the Jason Mopies, which is with my Friday the 13th collection. Um, a couple other little things, which was neat. So, this is the February one, so let's see what we have in here. Again, I have avoided spoilers for this one. I am going to try to do it blind, but i got to open it first and then obscure the addresses, because, as we said, you don't want to someone showing up at your house and telling me, hey man, I hit you, I love Bambox, and then they come at me, I don't know. But, let's do it this way, and I'm going to go, and oh, my dress is officially folded down. So I'm going to turn this up, I guess, I can't do it too blind, because it's a small box and not that many items on it. But the first one is a Dorbs, which Fox, my co-host on, on KP Sadis, he's, he's seen my, he's seen my pop collection. Um, I do have some Dorbs. They're the Batman ones in the corner, if you've ever seen them. But this is, um, not, not bad. You know, Peter Venkman, Bill Murray, you know, very cool. I'm not going to run out and get the rest of these. This, admittedly, might be something that goes in a trade box to somebody or gift, or one of my giveaways when I have them. Again, just 100 subscribers, folks, once they hit it. I got a couple of pretty cool things planned, including a couple of neckers I've been seeing on for a bit. Um, but, I don't, I like it, not gonna, I, the only duops I have are the Batman at ones, and I did that because I wanted, I didn't want to go after the Batman Pops, because I didn't want to break that seal and go for DC Pops, so I figured the duops is more of a one-shot thing. So, not bad, not bad, again, I didn't pay for anything for it, so, cool me. Let's see, we got, okay, we got a mystery, um, you know what these are, my emojis? Foxy, have you heard of these before? No, I have not. They are, I mean, it is a My Emoji Ghostbusters. I'm almost torn. Do I want to open this or do I want to save this and maybe give it to somebody else who might want it? You know what? I'm not going to open. I'm going to save it. I'm going to give it from one of my trade boxes. Um, these are things cool, though. Essentially, inside of these, you have these creatures just ahead with various facial expressions. But the thing that's really cool is you're given a digital code that you can send it and then you get a copy of whatever that emoji is. Specifically, the only way to get that one on your phone to use is through this. So that's pretty neat. I know you would love if there was a code to get one of those fox doves or dove, what are those pet pigeons? Trash thing? doves? Trash doves. Yeah, right? I know, right? If there's a trash dove emoji, but you would go nuts for Or a code to like just copy the image and save it. And you got a pencil. Okay, um, I, I've gotten one of these before. Um, oh, it's a pen, even better. I, I'll use this. That's a, you know, I, Is that an eraser? No, it's Leatherface. What? Oh, there we go. You know, very cool. I think the one we, I got before... Actually, no, my, you know what? My niece, I got her a box of Bobos, and they sent her a Jason one. So maybe I'll give this to her and, and introduce her to Weatherface, although... When you consider this, wow! <laughs> when you consider stuff other face good did, uncleing. I was gonna say when you consider stuff other face did, maybe that doesn't make it isn't too good of an uncle. Um, I think there's one more, yeah, one more thing in here, and this is something I oh, very nice. It's a DVD that is a, is autographed. It says limited limited Freddy Wong collection edition, so I'm gonna say maybe it's signed by Freddy Wong. Two young couples are driving through a remote forest when the car breaks down with a running with a curious... Huh. You know what? I might have actually seen this movie before. After seeing about it. But again, I've seen a few movies about killer bears, so... Someone's parch tastes yeah. a little too... Bloody. Ha <laughs> ha! You would be... That would be an excellent... Like, if this becomes a B-movie, instead of Prey Dead, that's what it should say. You know, someone's pirate, you know what? Uh, he took out Goldilocks and he wasn't done. Yeah. But, very cool. Box of Dread, I like it. It is a cheaper box, which is good if you're somebody that likes mystery boxes, but 
Um, well, it's really cheap for me since it was free. But I think traditionally it's only 20 bucks. So 20 bucks adorbs, you, know, you get your value because you got to factor shipping in there too, folks. So very cool. I like the stuff. It was nice. My last two unboxing of the day definitely made up, I think, for some of the band box fiasco. But maybe that's just me. Folks, you like, comment, all that stuff down below. If you didn't like, you can comment too. I'll, I'll get back to you. Okay, have a good one, folks.